Hi, welcome back to my channel. Uh -huh. So, if you follow my videos before, we already know how to export uh, the camera from the videos and then take the, all the animation from the videos, put it into the light wave, and then we already learn how to animate it. Okay, uh, in this videos, we're going to learn uh, the important part of this lesson is to render it all right and then we need to render it and then compose it into the videos to make it uh, cgi okay so let's uh, learn setting render setting okay this is my render setting okay uh, i'm going to show you what i like to do so i'm going to hit ctrl f9 for preview so this is the render preview all right so i'm going to uh, click shift c and then click the properties uh -huh. so from here i'm going to change all uh, keyframe from start uh, keyframe 1 to 151 right so 151 yeah okay so this is my render setting okay so i i uh, i put uh, the shading samples to 6 and i like samples to 6 okay so this actually the highest number you put the details this get but uh, the details it get to the longer time it take to render <laughs> so i think six is okay okay yeah so this is the global illumination so i'm going to enable the radio city so the radio city uh if you open it the light uh, will become uh, lighter uh, and that is bouncing the light and the models and then the models to the models let's say if you have uh, these goods and then you have this uh, floor or three so the lights uh, between this color and this color is bouncing one to other yeah so it's very very good very <laughs> uh, look like uh, realistic and all later you can change all the setting to the way you want but for now <laughs> yeah this is good so minimum samples also this one okay uh, this uh, sampling pattern I'm going to do classics okay so this is uh, that the sampling you have to click it okay if it is not click it then you have to click it so the minimum samples here uh, to make sure this don't have a jacket when you render right the edge uh -huh, you don't have a jacket so the, the adapter sampling is inside okay inside this is the edge this is the inside okay so if you don't put it uh, and then it'll be like <laughs> shaking uh, so you need to understand this okay all right so this light i will change to area uh -huh. at first let me change the background color okay so i'm going to change this control f6 uh -huh. i hit the control f6 okay, the background i change this first color to similar like this okay similar uh -huh. and then we have a green here uh -huh. okay now we have this so let's control uh, hit light and then I change the view part this is I'm going to hit file for light views I'm going to try follow similar yeah similar mm -hmm. no, almost there yeah i think this is okay okay of course you can try uh, another colors another yeah i think this is okay so of course you can change uh, the direction following this uh, light the sun here uh -huh. so i think this is already good as you can see this part is uh, dark but another part from above uh, is light have uh, a reflection of the light okay this is the area so area is like uh the shadow is not too sharp but it's not too uh too like this okay <laughs> uh the another one i like is a dome so dome as you can see is more pretty because the shadows is like a uh, smooth like that yeah but it doesn't suit this uh scene so that so the because just as a sun so that uh the the shadows is a pointy so i think this area is okay right 
so now we have setting this let's see mm -hmm. ta -da. Ta -da. okay all right so now you have uh, this like a uh, good render right but you need uh, the code to have a shadows so where you get uh, so where you get the shadows 